but the other day I published a video out on the channel where I talked about Scotty Scheffler's driver tip drill. And what I suggested was that Scotty Scheffler and a lot of the tour pros keep things ultra simple. And that way, if you keep it simple, you've got a much better chance of translating what you're working on in the range to what you're working on on the course. And what I said with Scotty Scheffler, is he puts a tee in the butt of the club and what he focuses on is in that backswing position he makes sure so if i'm aiming here pretty much straight down the fairway and i drew a line now that represents my target line you can see the way as i take the club back the club goes straight through the line the club shaft travels straight through the line and then as my right arm bends can you see the way now the club shaft points at the line and that's what all the pros work on that's what scotty scheffler talks about what i then said in that video is if you allow your right arm to straighten back through that line and the butt of that T peg is again pointing towards, say, the center line of your stomach, that means you're going to release that club head nice onto the back of the ball, and then again you can swing through, keeping that club on plane. There's absolutely no doubt that inconsistency always comes from golfers who aim, you know, left or right, let's aim left for this example, and then when you take it back, you come in on a different line, and then when you come down, you come on a different line, because how are you ever going to be able to do two things? The same? You're never going to hit two shots the same if you haven't got that sort of, you know, understanding of the basics of swing playing principles. So I meet a lot of students that reach out for help, whether it's face to face or whether it's online. And to be honest with you, it's always the basic stuff that we're doing. We're making sure that the people understand or, or the student and the golfer understands, you know, making sure that club is supposed to travel straight back like so not this sort of you know quirkiness anything just keep the club head traveling in a straight line get the club shaft pointing at a straight line and then as you swing through because even if you miss hit one if you keep doing the same sort of things you're always going to have a much better chance of finding more consistency on a day-to-day -day basis so all of that being said let's see if i can hit one somewhere down the fairway so par five here at west midlands we're on the uh, four fifth hole Okay, like so. And there we go, a nice tee shot somewhere down the fairway. I'll see you soon. <laughs>